I know nothing about this. Okay, would you let artificial intelligence plan your trip? I don't know. Well, that's exactly what influencer Michael Matamedi from Los Angeles does. He is oh. using GuideGeek's travel assistant to plan a year of trips. The AI tells him everything, where to go, where to eat, places to see. I think that AI is really the future in a lot of respects. For me, I've been using it strictly as an experiment to see what would happen if I let go and I relinquished all control to AI to travel the world. And it's given me some of the best experiences I've ever had. Travel industry experts say AI won't replace people, but will improve their performance and your experience. Do you remember back in the day when you and I, we, when we hosted the movie show, we, yeah. we, our version of AI back then was we threw, <laughs> we literally threw a dart Our. at a dartboard to pick what movies would come become. We're movies. off. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so instead of throwing a dart, okay, we, our producer Tanner and I got on this AI thing okay, and we tested out the where, AI where travel going? assistant. I told it if we were going on a hypothetical Arc Cincinnati trip, you and Hi I, if we were going to film somewhere, uh, we were going on a destination with a budget of $5,000 <laughs> for a week-long trip. That's the funniest part of this <laughs> well, whole thing. wait till thing. you hear what it told us to do. $5,000. Right. Wait till you hear oh what gosh. it came up with, right? Okay. Because I don't think you could even fly to some of these places for $5,000. Okay. But here's what it says. It says, a mystery adventure sounds thrilling. Yes. With a budget of $5,000, $1,000 for a week-long trip this summer. We can definitely find some exciting options. And this for is you all your AI. AI. This is all this you're is reading. AI talking to me. Okay. Yep. How about considering these destinations for your mystery adventure? Ready, Bob? Number okay. one was Southeast Asia. All right. Explore vibrant cities, stunning landscapes, and rich cultures in countries like Thailand, Vietnam, Cambodia. From the bustling markets to ancient temples, Southeast Asia is a perfect blend of adventure and mystery. Now, I have been to Thailand, and I agree that it is a place I would go back to. My mother is here in town, and she's watching right now, and she would probably agree that it costs more than $5,000 to get there I, and well, enjoy it. It looks, is, is that picture from Thailand? Do we I know, don't know where that, that picture's from? more like Vietnam, but I, I, I don't know. I don't know, know where it's from. Where is it, it from? Oh, it is Thailand, okay. Well, I there you go. Yeah, I, uh, I mean, it looks stunning. It looks, and, and all joking aside, Thailand was incredible. I bet. I'll go back in a heartbeat if I had the time. And? Um, the five thousand dollars and more than five thousand dollars probably <laughs> to do that where else can uh, we go okay no, the second recommendation from ai was south america embark on an i forget like i'm on the prices right when they do this and you've won a trip to south america embark on an unforgettable journey through countries like oh, peru ecuador that. and colombia discover the mysteries of machu picchu ah. the amazon rainforest and the vibrant cities of lima and bogota okay. now again that looks stunning i would go in a heartbeat if i had is and I, you know, time? you know, I like the hiking. They're clearly hiking. Didn't you know, right one of there. Your children go to Peru. Did Chloe went there. Yeah. Absolutely, she did. She Chloe's a planner. I would. Yeah. I don't want AI to plan my trip. I want my oldest you want daughter. Your daughter to, yeah. I want her to plan. And she's actually planned trips for friends. I wonder if she um, would use AI. I, I get know. what they're saying. Let it kind of like pick. Give you a little. Yeah. A hint, a tip, some, whatever. Some flavors. Okay, but we're not done. Okay. Uh, no, Where else are we gonna go? Door number three leads to Eastern Europe. Eastern. Delve into the lesser known corners of Europe oh. by visiting countries like Romania, Bulgaria, and Hungary. Explore medieval castles, charming villages, and hidden gems that will surely add an element of mystery to your adventure. I will go every single place sure. that AI is telling me to. Will AI <laughs> pay for it? No. no. Uh, let's go to the last one because that looks okay. just stunning. And this is on my list. My I like castles. List. I'm a big castle me guy. Too. Me too. Yeah. Uh, but then, and this last one. Visit the, Morocco. The Kingdom of Light? Immerse yourselves in the enchanting world of Morocco with the oh, bustling... Oh, uh, so much light. Them, the ancient Medinas, the, the breathtaking landscapes Movement. from the vibrant city of Marrakesh to the Sahara Desert. This North African gem offers a unique blend of mystery and adventure. What? Remember, Bob, the world is full of surprises and the destination can become a mystery adventure if you approach it with an open mind and a sense. Is that the Moroccan curiosity. Travel Bureau's like <laughs> like know. promo video? Okay, that's that's kind of what yeah. I figured it was. It uh, looks I, very exciting. I don't exciting. know, but I would, I would go to any and all of these places. Yes. <laughs> you know, about as close as I can get, and I don't even think you can do this on a $5,000 budget, is you get you to Epcot, and you just go around the world showcase. Boom. You Which hit. you and I have done. Absolutely, we've done. for a show. Absolutely. Yes. I would like to show you some of the raw footage, but our producer erased it. <laughs> he did. That's also a very true story. Uh, but I, I think it is neat. The idea of using AI to generate ideas, maybe, like things yeah. you've never thought of before. But I call me old fashioned. I, I, I want to talk to, in some cases, somebody who's been there, who's, who's done the thing, um, who's explored a place so they can they can tell it to me in their terms right. like a person that i trust again yeah um, it's to fun to be able to like maybe 
sometimes I don't know where I want to go on my next vacation, sure. and I let like Google Flights yeah, yeah. kind of help me find sort it. Because if you've never used Google Flights before, it will tell you like if you know a time frame, like the next six months, I'd like to go someplace. I've found really cheap flights to places right. that I didn't think I was going to go to, but I'm like, I'm going to try that because the flight's two hundred dollars. On, on top of everything else with the AI, the thing that's stunning to me is not so much that it will generate a list of ideas, but it will present it to you. In, in very human-like yeah. language, you know, written yeah. in a way that probably scrawls it out better than 80% of the people could, could write it out to you. That, that, to me, is as fascinating as it being able to just present different yeah. ideas of where to travel. Yeah. Um, and then I was just thinking the other day, we did that story um, where the secretary of the Air Force went up in the completely AI-controlled right. F-16. Nope. I just, no, I would not. it's all That's, like, the, like we're living in the future. All of the movies we watched, like it's happening. Yep. Like right now it's happening. Except for the flying cars. We, we're still raining. We've been doing stories on flying cars for it's 20 years. Day one I've been here. Haven't seen one yet. Still waiting. Yeah. <laughs> hey there. Yeah, you could stop watching right now, but let's be honest. You don't want to do that. Hit the links or click subscribe to see more amazing content from all of us here at Local 12.